I'm stud. And do you see this gun right here? It is one of the rarest weapons in the game. These rare weapons are classified as special grade weapons. It's literally right there. And there's a bunch scattered throughout the maps, but most of them you have to kill boss zombies to get. So I'm gonna show you where to find all of these boss zombie locations and weapon spawns. And as you can see, this recording was very successful. I literally even found rare weapons. All right, let's jump into the first location. All right, so the first boss zombie that spawns a special weapon is that destroyer shipwreck. So the Vagrant Lupara is dropped by the freaking Hobo King zombie, which is a boss zombie in this game. So that means that there's only a chance that it'll drop, and I'm pretty sure that the boss zombie spawns somewhere out here, and uh, it's not here. As soon as I stopped recording, he came out of nowhere. He was here! Um, so yeah, you find him here. I guess he can be in the boat, but he just came out of nowhere. But this time he didn't spawn the item. He did not spawn the Vagrant Lupara, but uh, there is a chance that he can. All right, on these islands and islands across the map, I think even on like shores. So like here I've seen it, I've seen it here. I know it can spawn at like these two. There is a pirate zombie. And that pirate zombie will drop the broadside shotgun. But as you can see, I do not think that the zombie is here right now. So uh, that's unfortunate. But this zombie can also spawn the pirate rucksack. And it can spawn the scurvy, which is actually super overpowered for, like, combat. All right, so we just landed our boat, and we are right here between mines and the resort. And we are looking for the rogue zombie. The rogue zombie will drop the rogue Uzi, so that's what we're trying to look for. It is located somewhere roaming between the mines and this little location right here. So it's looking like he's not here, but uh, he will be located in this area. Um, I don't know if he would go as far as to here, um, but yeah, he did not spawn for me. So let's move on to the next location. All right, so we're pulling up to our next location, and uh, these next three zombies are all located very close to each other. So the first one is going to be where we're going to find the silent partner at Coastal Bunkers, the island right below it. He's going to spawn here. It's just going to be a lonesome zombie. And he will drop the silent partner, which is like a secondary pistol. It's a decent gun. Um, but it does not look like he's here right now. All right, so he was at neither of the islands So let's move on to the next one which is literally right at coastal bunkers The next item is the spetnaz ak and you're gonna have to search inside of coastal to find it All right, so this is where you're gonna find the spetnaz zombie down this little path inside of coastal He's gonna spawn here and oh my gosh So this is the guy that's gonna drop the pkm the guy that drops the spetnaz has like a helmet on so it's completely different than this one But it can be down here Oh, I found an AKM. I found a PKM, bro. What the? Let's go, dude. Well, that's a rare weapon spawn for you if you didn't know where that was, but we're doing the special weapon spawns right now. All right, and the next location is literally right beside the last one. It's at Admiral's House. So this is the Admiral's House if you've never been here before. It spawns a boss zombie named the Admiral, and uh, let's see if it spawns the Admiral's M9, which is a special weapon that they just added. Well, if this Admiral zombie's down here, I might be in some trouble, and uh, no, he's not. But the Admiral Zombie will spawn down here. He spawns the Admiral's M9 and a bunch of other stuff I can't think of off the top of my head right now. But another thing that can spawn at Admiral's house is the filtered AKS. It will spawn in like an ATV around the Admiral's house, which I am not seeing, so I don't think that's here either. But yeah, it's not here. I think I've only seen an ATV one time and it was like over by Fairview, so maybe it can spawn by Fairview too. I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, let's move on to the next location. Guys, I just killed so many zombies and I think one of them just dropped something crazy. Oh, it's just the AKS. Um, I'm gonna die though, so that's tough. Um, it's been a good life. Oh my god, hold on. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. I'm literally so close to death. If one zombie hits me, I'm dead. Alright, what was this? What did you drop? Spetnaz AK! No way, he dropped the Spetnaz! Okay, I found one in the video. That's pretty clutch. So this little thing right here, if you see it, definitely go loot it. It has the freaking Spetnaz AK, dude. What am I going to do with the PKM now? I'm definitely taking the Spetnaz AK. I stopped my recording again for two seconds. And I find the 5.45 millimeter Soviet ammo can. This is literally for my Spetnaz AK. This is crazy. My luck right now is insane. Oh, no way. Not a chance am I this lucky right now. This one is where you find the sweeper desert eagle, but he did not drop it. So that sucks. So there's a chance that he can drop the sweeper desert eagle. This guy way in the back right here. 
And uh, he did not drop it this time, so that really freaking sucks. But the Sweeper Desert Eagle is like insane in this game. But what these are, these are trucks that spawn randomly around the map. And uh, these are like the party bus. I think that's what it's called. Like the disco looking zombie guys. It's still cool that I literally found these like right beside each other. All right, so we're pulling up to the next location, which is where you find the Obrez Mosin. So the zombie that spawns the Obrez Mosin is going to spawn outside of Junkyard and east of it in the rocky area. So around these rocks is essentially where it will spawn. And keep in mind, it's not guaranteed that it'll spawn every time. So there's probably a low chance that we're actually going to find it. But uh, I'm going to check every single one of these rocks really quick. And if there's not one, then uh, that sucks because I really want the Obrez. All right, so I couldn't find the Obrez. I checked all these rocks. And, uh, you know, that's okay. We literally have a freaking Spetnaz AK. We're good. But uh, we're actually going to check the next spot. Um, it's the Jeremiah, and it is going to be located at the shack right above campground. All right, so we are pulling up to the shacks right north of campground. And keep in mind that these zombies can spawn in or around these places. So uh, if they're not there, they could just be like wandering in the forest. And uh, it looks like it is not at this one. So let me go check the other one, which is just right over in that direction. All right, I was completely wrong about this. You're actually going to want to go to this building on the map. I went to the buildings north of that. You don't want to go to those. I think that it's actually at the one which is like straight west of campground. All right, the next two items can be found at no other place than prison. So the two items that you can find here are going to be the MAC-10 snake in the stunted AK-47. And both of them are going to be located within the interior of the main part of the prison. So now we gotta find the prison showers. All right, so here is the showers. And what are you? Are you the guy I'm looking for? Uh, no, you're not. Okay, well, down here, the snake can spawn. There's a custom zombie. I'll show you a picture of it. And uh, it can spawn the Snake Mac 10, which is like a crazy Mac 10. And uh, sadly, it's not here. Dude, these zombies are rare. It's hard to find them. I got extremely lucky with this Spetnaz. All right, so inside of the cells, there can be a zombie with a white do rag, and that zombie will spawn the stunted AK. But it looks like there is a severe lack of zombies here, so uh, I, I don't see him anywhere. All right, so the next weapon is located nowhere else but the Forest of Huron. In the Forest of Huron, you have the chance to run into the big boss. The big boss is gonna spawn south of Chapel, which is up here, and it has a chance to drop the Patriot Carbine. Or Assault Rifle, it's one of them, dude, I don't know. Oh my god, that's him! That's him! Holy crap! Oh my gosh, he was so fast! Well, there he is! He was here! <laughs> he almost murked me! Dude, that's crazy. He didn't drop anything good, but dude, look at him. Look, he's all sad because he just got murdered by another zombie. Oh my gosh, is that him? That's him! Look, oh my god, he's so fast! Whoa, dude, and I'm almost dead? Patriot, oh my gosh, there's no freaking way. I'm sorry, but there's just no way. What gun do I take, dude? The, what? The, I think I might just like ruin my entire inventory for this stupid special weapon. But how about that, dude? That was my second try trying to get it. I literally got it on my second try. The next weapon is the Resolved Katana. You're actually going to have to go to the mines for this item, and uh, you're going to have to kill a freaking caveman zombie all right so this is where you go once you go into the cave so you're gonna run straight on you're gonna check this crate there is nothing you're gonna take a right you're gonna run down this long hallway you're gonna take a left at this gate run straight down this way you're gonna continue running until you reach this little section you're gonna turn left and then you're gonna get to this area you're gonna turn right down this hallway and you're just gonna follow this until you turn left into this cave. I am starving to death, dude. Come on. And then once you get to this little area, you're not going to go down there. You're going to continue to go straight down this hallway. And I think that the location is literally right here. Oh my gosh. Do I hear him? That's him right there. Do you see him? Oh my gosh. He's coming. Sneak attack. 
holy crap, he did so much damage, and he didn't drop it, dude. Come on. Why don't you ever drop it? All right, the next location will be at Smuggler Airship, and you're going to try to find the Smuggler Pilot. So I'm not exactly sure where this uh, pilot spawns. I've never ran into him, but I know that it's somewhere at Smugglers here. Those are pretty much all the weapons where I know the location of. When I find out where the other, like, two are, I will put them in the description. But anyways, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and do it. There's going to be a lot more videos on this game. I am enjoying Apocalypse Rising 2 a lot. And I spent so much time on this video going to every single location. It took forever. But thank you for watching and uh, subscribe right now.